What is up everyone? It's your boy Mad Panda. I hope you guys are having a great day and today we're gonna be playing Marvel's Avengers part 30. Uh, we're gonna be doing the Captain America iconic mission. So uh, yeah, let's begin. Yeah, I, I did these already. I like I said before I just didn't really pay attention to the story. I was actually looking at YouTube videos. I said this before. So uh, I don't know anything about the story or storyline. been spreading their lies about the resistance for way too long. It has to stop. It's time we replace their poisonous lies with the truth. But their satellite array is vast. As long as that network is in place, they'll control the narrative. Jarvis has identified several AIM satellite hubs that control their communications. I see what you're thinking. If we can take one out, their network would collapse. At least for a few hours. We'd be able to send messages to the entire Resistance. Temporarily. So we'll have to make every word we broadcast count. But we don't have any weapons strong enough to take out a satellite, so what's the play? The satellite is connected to Earth by a massive space elevator. That's how we'll get up there. Alright, interesting. I don't think these two missions are connected. I think, wait, let me see what heroes I have. Oh, okay, uh, should we go random? You know what, I'm gonna go Black Widow, Kate Bishop, and, uh, not Captain Marvel, fuck that. And uh, Tony, I guess. Alright, yeah, so I don't think these missions are actually connected. I think they're just their own missions, but I think if I remember correctly, the, first thing you'll have to the do Thor is acquire one was the connected. Code for this Both missions. Space elevator. That'll be risky. It'll be worth it, Hill. The resistance is still fragile. We need a way to organize our forces. Open lines of communications will be critical. Okay, that was not Yeah, like I was saying before, actually, I'm starting kind of to... I'm, get, I'm, I'm, I'm getting used to this armor. I, I didn't like it at first, the one that Captain has right now, but uh, it's it's honest it's honestly because of the years. I'm not I'm not used to it. You know, I think it was like that in the comics, but on uh, well, the new series. But uh, I don't know. It, it, it kind of felt weird, especially without the little wings on his uh, helmet. But I'm I'm kind of getting used to it. It it looks really like classic Captain America. You know what it really reminds me of? It reminds me of that uh, Captain America film that never came out. Uh, with the red skull, the I really assume crappy you know where to find one. a set of codes. Jarvis did some digging. A local AIM base commander has some, so we're gonna pay them a visit. Yeah, that film was made in like the 1980s or 70s, I think. I think it was the 80s. But yeah, it's uh, it looks funny as hell. I really like the gauntlets. So that actually looks pretty cool. All right, let's get it. All right. Let's go get those launch codes. I think this one might actually be a longer mission than normal. Oh. Longer mission than normal. There is a chest been... with gear close by. Oh yeah, I'm not. I'm, I'm gonna skip all the gears. I already got that before when I played this mission. But uh, when I've been playing Captain America recently a lot, and uh, he's practically the the hero I have the highest level with, even with power level. I think he's 75 or 76 if I remember correctly. And he's level 50. The the base commander. The one in the and the regular level. Yes. Let's get his attention. But, uh... One thing that kind of annoys me is that, you know, he's a super soldier. So you'd expect him to, like, at least run a bit faster than, like, this, you know? With special resources close to your local I wouldn't mind if they let us run, like, twice this speed, but... I feel like he's a bit too slow for being a super soldier. Oh, what the heck? Oh, shit. I'm dead. Yep. Yeah, I was stuck there. I, I couldn't even move there. Black Widow coming in clutch. Thank you. I just did her iconic mission, so I'll uh, go check that out. Yeah, these laser cannons are like the most annoying ones, so that's what I normally focus on the most. Let's see if I could tell the fast from here. I think I get extra damage every time I do this. This feels like I'm not doing anything there. Damn. You know what? I could probably get this back pretty quickly. Since uh, I'd be getting heroic orbs with Captain America now, like non stop. Oh, crap.
Oh, that was nice. You see? Freaking heroic corpse for days, bro. Let's get it. I'm gonna try to do that with, like, when I start leveling up the other heroes. Who's healing? Oh, I thought it was an adaptoid. Yeah, I gotta break this thing. These are so nice. Oh, wow. Did it break? Okay, that. But I could probably. No, you know what? I'm not gonna use my ultimate. I feel like we have this under control. Can I tag more parts? Nope. Okay. That's a pretty decent amount of damage. All right. There we go. Extracting the launch codes now. I wonder if I could actually reach all the way over there. The Damn elevator it. is controlled by a multi-point authentication system powered by three junction boxes. That was so freaking close. Them to fake the authentication to get you inside. Why can't it ever be easy? Okay, that's not what I was aiming for, but uh, I guess I'll take it. I think I could just run through this. There's gonna be a shit ton of turrets though. Oh, how awesome would it have been if I actually hit it right off the spot? I thought there was another one. Hmm. I think I remember this part. I think you gotta hold down this area. So is this like an elevator? An uh, interstellar elevator? Look for a chest with gear nearby. One of our shield allies nearby could use some help. There we go. I do like double jump. Get access to the three junctions, keeping the security system locked down so Jarvis can get inside. Aim's gonna try to kick him out, so you'll need to keep their forces at bay. This part should be pretty simple. Just gotta hold these uh, Keep at A, B, and C down pretty, pretty easy. I'm gonna I'm gonna use my ultimates right when we get to them. Just so that I could like go out Jarvis like go is all out without like any interruptions. There we go. Oh, I got both of them? Holy oh, crap. Oh damn it. I don't use that ability that much. I should probably use it. I keep forgetting that I could uh, deflect you know, projectiles with the shield. You know, that's uh, what a shield should be for, you know. The ones and zeros he's spitting out seem promising, but we need to keep control of the junctions. Oh, wait, which one are we losing? Hold up. B? Where the fuck is B? Oh, okay, I see it. Aim's got a junction back. We'll stop. Okay, yeah, that's not good. Avengers, charge! Got you a present! Great job! Damn, freaking two heroic orbs, Jesus. You have to get aim off those junctions. They took like the one on top already? God damn. We should be good though. I think I should have used broken blot right about now. There we go. I wonder how many I could tag with like all these going on. Oh, we're losing these. Damn. He's got a junction back. We'll stop them. This is the only way to actually run pretty decently fast. We're just shield out. Wait, why do I have my uh, side abilities ready? Damn. Nice. I think we got this. Yep. Those dudes with the shields are so annoying. But the worst ones are the ones that teleport. I've always said that. I'll take that. I was like, where the hell is it going? <laughs> oh no, that's not what I was trying to do. Security locks on the elevator have been disabled. You're clear to go, Cap. All right. Well, that's good. One super long elevator ride coming up. 
Yeah, how does that even work? How did they even manage to have like... I don't think there's not enough metal in the world a to even warning, make an sir. elevator, that's all, right? This is going to be a rather rocky ride. Oh. Everyone hold on! Incredible. No telling what kind of defenses this satellite has. Unless it's more like a launch pad. Set the place to self-destruct and then get the hell up. Clear? Crystal. That might actually just work, like kind of like a pod. Like you like stay there and then like it just launches you to space. But I think it's more like an elevator from multiple what we see. <laughs> enemies coming online now. What's the plan? We'll fight our way to the central hub and overload their power systems. <laughs> I love doing that. I think Loki is becoming my favorite Avenger to use. Central hub's doors. The crazy thing is that when I started playing Taking Aim a couple a couple days ago, he was like the weakest hero I had, I think. And uh, now he's literally the one I've played with the aim most. Aim really likes redundancies, don't they? They do. You got to take everything down, or that satellite will stay up. I kind of wish we had more like space missions. Like the one in the campaign. And this one, I guess. We're standing by, Cap. Oh, we shit. The satellite out. We'll send out a message as wide as possible. That's the most I've ever seen in one area. That are able to do a finisher with. Damn, we went off. God damn. Oh, wait. I gotta pull this? Alright. Damn it. He spooked me that though for a second. I ain't even gonna lie. Power overloading across the station. Yeah, take that. Yeah, I'm just gonna use my uh I think I should be good. I think they're they constructed well enough. This may shock you. I might have to use this. Oh wait, I can't. It's like an EMP. Oh, I was about to say it's not breaking. Diverting all power to maintaining station integrity. Okay, this is where it's about to get fun. The array is beginning to fall apart. We're able to transmit to our outpost on the east coast. And soon the world. There we go. Wait, how, can I block these? Nope. Hey, thanks. I'm literally about to die. Yep. That's what I was fearing. I think Iron Man's coming through, yep. He should pull out his Hulk buster right about now. I'm only doing that as a distraction while I pull this out. That's your last I had to use that, I really did not have a choice. Jesus. I don't remember it being this hard. Holy crap! Yeah, Brooklyn Baller has to be one of the best ultimates in the game. It's just so freaking OP, dude. Especially when you have like the mastery levels unlocked or abilities. Communication has compromised. Station destruct imminent. Get ready to broadcast. Nice. Get out of there! The Before we go, I want to take that purple thing right over there. There we go. Alright, I'm getting the hell out of here. Oh, what the way, Kate? Can I jump with my ship? Kinda. Oh, shit, it's an explosive thing. Is that gonna hit anyone? Nope. Oh no, we left Black Widow behind. <laughs> oh, that was it. Wow. That was actually shorter than I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be one of the longer ones. I think it's longer when you get like uh, the, the rewards scattered around the map and stuff, like the trophy chests. Oh, that was actually shorter than I thought it was. Yeah. It was alright. Broadcast the message. Certainly, sir. This is Captain America. To anyone out there resisting the tyranny of AIM. To everyone who's scared or doesn't know where to turn. The Avengers are back. 
and we won't let you down again. All right, I think that's where I'm going to begin the video here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.